Hey everybody, welcome to uh, some live coffee mug research. I thought I'd try something different. I'm actually going to try and go on to Facebook and YouTube at the same time. So if you want, go to YouTube and go search for my channel, PPC Coach, and you'll find me on there too. Um, try them both, which is crazy. Just check on the comments here. Just making sure these work. If you're here, if you're seeing this, I know I didn't really announce this or anything, but just come into the comments and let me know you're here. If you guys have any questions, let me know, and then I'll basically record. Oh, actually, start recording. All right, so we're going to do some live coffee mug research today. Uh, if anybody's on here, just give me a hello in the comments so I know you're here. I know I didn't really announce this, but uh, we're going to try it anyway. So, got a little program that I use called Caster, and it seems to be working well. I can see everything on both dashboards, which is very cool. So, I'm going to try and see if I can get the comments in both here. Just let me get set up on the back end. There we go. Okay, good to go. Awesome. Okay, so here we are. Um, as you know, I've got uh, the Funny Coffee Mug Challenge coming up basically tomorrow. So I wanted to show you guys how easy these things are to find and how we can get them made and how it works really awesome. So one of my favorite places to go is Pinterest. As you can see, you can find a whole bunch of these. And when you open it in a, in a new tab, you'll get like this one at the top of the screen. So the chains on my mood swing just snapped, run. But when you scroll down, you get a lot of related ones too. So you could basically spend like a lot of time on here. So I thought I'd go through a couple just to show you guys how we can do research and uh, find quite a bit so like that awful moment you realize this is your circus and those are your monkeys it's kind of funny uh, a lot of people have a lot of mugs on etsy too which you can get to and their etsy has this little program where you can post all your listings right to um right to pinterest like automatically i can't remember how i haven't been on my etsy store i've actually got a couple etsy stores but like, let's eat kids, <laughs> let's eat comma kids, punctuation and saves lives, and that's for, like, a teacher, but that could be for anybody. So I wanted to go through a couple and uh, show you how I do it. So I do not spew profanities, I enunciate them clearly, like a fucking lady. Nice. I looked up my symptoms online, and it turns out I just have kids. I'm no cactus expert, but I know a prick when I see one. Uh, this one is uh, not a coffee mug, but still a cool saying. Uh, sarcasm because murder charges are expensive so again open it up and you'll see a lot of related ones too down here which is very very interesting some of the stuff they come up with I'm fine but the rest of you need therapy some people need a high five in the face with a chair so I really like this one I've seen this a lot and I actually have done one of these so what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to use snag it and I'm going to grab it. Oh, hang on. Snag it is over here. So this is Snag it. It's a really good program. And you just hit capture. And then it'll do this little thing. I don't know if it's showing. It might have, may have frozen the screen when I did that. But I just take a screenshot. And then I've got my screenshot over here. And I can save it. So I can go file. Save as. Now this is all by other monitor. But uh, we'll go to some people... Need a high five. Okay. So now I'm going to show you what I do with this. Oh, I see a couple of people on there. Hey, Kabir. Hey, Walter. How's it going? A couple of people watching live. Awesome. Let's see if I can find people on YouTube. We've got two people watching on YouTube. I see you. So just say something. Just say hi in the chat if you guys are there. I'm just trying this out just to see how this works. Because I have no idea. This is my first time going live on two places at once. So I've got this. So now I'm going to go actually to over here. Let me get this set up. .com sheets. Okay. So I've got a new Google Sheet here. And on this, I'm going to name it uh, Coffee Mug Research. And then in here, I'm going to put uh, the image, and then I'm going to put the quote, 
I guess. And then I'll put status. And then I'm going to put something like... Uh, no, well, we'll just do those for now. So then I'm going to make this look funny. The weird thing about this is um, it's really delayed. Like there's a 20 to 40 second delay between what I say and what appears on the screen. So it really throws me off a little bit in the comments, but I'm getting used to it on these live streams. All right, so I got my image. So now all I'm going to do is go like this. Oh, hey, Joe. Hey, Mark. Let's see ya. See if anybody else is on YouTube. No, YouTube is something I've, I've been really getting into because I want to make it go huge. And uh, there's so much money on YouTube, it's insane. So here we go. So I'm going to add the image here. So I'm going to insert image, image and cell. And I'm going to choose an image to upload. Oh, hang on. Got to be careful on these lives because I can reveal a little bit too much. So image, image and cell. Oh, that's fine. Okay, I'll bring that back. So choose an image. And there it is. So it's the mug up that I just found. And you can see it looks super small, like in the corner. So what you need to do is drag down this height. And then you can drag over this. Just so you can read the thing. There. That's pretty good. And then for the quote, you just type it in. So you put some, some people need a high five in my face. Oh, need a high five. And then in the face with a chair. There. And then for under status, I'll just put pending. There we go. And then I'll go back. So I'll move this out of the way. And I'll go back over here to Pinterest. And I'll say, what else do I see? Keep talking. I'm diagnosing you. It's okay. I'm on 500 milligrams of fuck it all. <laughs> oh, some of these are funny. My next week, I'm totally getting my shit together. I can't really read the bottom, but videos could fly. This place would be an airport. Oh, well, that's interesting. So let's open that one up. And this is on... Oh, that's another thing. If you find this, so cute but rude. So you can actually click here and go to their store, which is neat too. So cute but rude is a store that has, uh, well, I guess cute but rude stuff. <laughs> Tears of my clients. I'm so glad I swiped right. Uh, coffee mugs, feminist, funny and rude. So what I can do is, I like this, this, this mug. So I'm going to, again, I'm going to take my screenshot there, save, and then I'm going to save this on my other, just over here, I'm on my other screen. I'll go file, save as, and this one will be, if idiots could buy. Then I'll go back into my sheet, my sheet, oh, there it is, back into my sheet, and I'll just add this, so I'll go again, insert, image, image and cell, upload, like choose, videos can fly, and then just pull that down, there we go, and then you go, if idiots could fly, this place would be an airport pending all right let's go back i love doing this stuff this is actually the best part of this whole thing so now that i'm on this person's store let's see if we can find anything else do they have best sellers uh so if this looks like so i'm just going to view view page source i'm going to see if it is shopify which it is so i'm going to go back here and then for shopify Best sellers link or URL, whatever it is. So it's this uh, sort by best selling. So I'll show you what to do here. So I go here and it, I just want to grab this. Oh, I can even try this. So I'll take collections all sort by best selling and then I'll go back here. So even if they turned it off, I think I should be able to get it. Maybe. There. So 
Now you can go to any store and you can see what their best selling stuff is. Mum of sassholes. Oh my god, that's funny. Okay, so I just found one. Wait, so these like are sorted in an order of best selling. Well, I even have it here. They didn't disable it. So Shopify stores are nice because they actually let you go and uh, <laughs> take. I'll probably spill this. That's awesome. It's beginning to look a lot like fuck this. Nice. Sorry I'm late. I got here as soon as I wanted. Sorry you had to raise my brother. <laughs> I speak fluent toddler. Uh, GG sippy cup. Don't scare me. I fart easily. Oh man. Look at you buying a house and shit. Nice. My favorite people call me Pop Pop. So these are all like real cool, like funny ones. So Tears of My Client. I know I've seen that one all over the place. And watch. Tears of My Client. If we go to images. Yeah, you see a whole bunch of them. So I do like this. So let's just grab one. Again, it's going back to Pinterest. But let's do a screen grab here of this. This will be my next one. Save, and then file, save as. Here's my client. Then let's go here, and let's put this one in. So insert, image, image and cell, choose. Here's my clients. So we move this down. I'll make that a little bit bigger. There we go. I'll go like this. Tears of my clients pending. Awesome. All right. So I'm going to get a couple more. Uh, this time I'm going to go not just on Pinterest, right? Because Pinterest is awesome. And so is Shopify. But let's close tabs to the right. And let's go to good old Etsy. And if you guys were on the webinar, uh, well, that's somebody's store. But let's go to Etsy. Welcome back. So if you're on the webinar, you saw me do this. Funny coffee mugs. And here's what we need to look for on Etsy. Um, the ones basically, when you type that in, the ones that are coming up here. So these, this top row where it says ad, those are ads. But down here, these are actually um, coffee mugs. So what we want to do is find like best sellers. Uh, now one thing you're going to run into. Oh my God, that's so rude. Uh, Jesus, wow. If you have a lot of like profanity and curse words, uh, you're going to have a lot of difficulty running that on Facebook because they do not like that. So you have to find stuff that doesn't have profanity. So like there's one, like I do what I want with the cat, giving the finger coffee because brat, brat, bleh, crack is bad for you. But you can see some of these are labeled as best sellers. And this is the one that I showed um, on the webinar. So I found this, and a lot of people actually afterwards, they, I pushed this in the group already, but they gave me a lot of crap for this because they said, that's so inappropriate, you can't do that. But it's like Jeffrey Dahmer and I eat guys for breakfast. I thought it was hilarious. And if you look here for this item, there's 149 like reviews. So when you look down here at the reviews, you can see for the shop, there's 1600 for the item, there's 149. So if this is somebody's shop on here, I apologize. Looks like it's Anna, but I'd, like, I don't know if it's really a woman. On, online, you never know. It could be. But there are a lot of guys that create shops and they put female names because it sells better. So I'm just going to show you what I do with this. Now, the other issue is, is his uh, likeness or whatever trademarked? I don't know. I mean, I know the guy's dead, and I know he was a silly serial killer, but I have no idea. So guys like you for breakfast. There we go. Then I'll go back to my sheet, and I'll just add this. Go down here. I'm going to insert image, image and cell. Choose an image to upload. That one. And then we'll just drag her down again. And then it's, and I did try to order this and the guy, they don't deliver to Canada. So what the hell? Like, come on guys, guys like you for breakfast. I just think it's a funny pun because it's like a play on words and 
it takes people a second to get it too. But that's a good one. So we got four already, and we've only been doing this for what, like a couple minutes? I don't know. It doesn't feel like very long. So let's go back in here and move that over. And then we will go and see what else we can find. So go back here. Um, this one too is one I found on the webinar. So I'm going to show you guys this one. <laughs> so it's a bestseller. Uh, and again, on Etsy. Well, let's see what else we got. Oh, cool. Available colors. Bluefish mugs, 15 and 11 ounce. Print on both sides. So that's actually... If you're on Etsy, you might want to add these images to your thing later. But for us, we don't. We're going to be looking at Facebook ads for this. So this item has 28 reviews. So uh, for the item alone, for the shop, it's got 158. Right? It used to be they only had it for the shop, but now they have it for both. So it's actually a neat way to kind of do some research. So what I would suggest is do not make like don't just copy the guy, but you could easily take this and do a screenshot and add it to your research folder. And then you could say, uh, you could take this screenshot and you could send it to a designer on Fiverr and you could say, hey, can you do something like this, but make it completely different? So if you're holding up his mug in one hand and your mug in another, it has to look completely different. Otherwise you're copying. We don't want to do that. So let's go back to our sheet and let's add this one. Right here, I'll go insert image, image and cell, choose an image. There we go. And scroll that one down. And then, so this is what, uh, now the other thing is, uh, the word bitch, uh, is doc, you can't run that on Facebook. So, what if you change that to what now? Uh, I don't know. I don't, I'm trying to think of a word that is not like vulgar that we could use in there. I actually can't even come up. But what now, dude? What now, my dear? What now, uh, a hole? I don't know. You could use, you could probably use a hole, but you can't like use like asshole because that, that would be not allowed. So, what you're seeing is basically what I do, um, in my forums and in my training, this is what I'm going to be teaching people. So I thought I'd give you guys like a live taste here. We're coming up on about 20 minutes and uh, I do have stuff I have to do today. So what I'm going to post this replay up in the uh, site, but I'm also going to show you this. If you guys want, um, what I'd like you to do, I'll move this over, is go here. So I mean, I could spend all day doing this, but I'm not going to. So ppccoach.com. This is what I want to show you. Right now, I've got a free trial. Well, not a free trial, a dollar trial. And I'm starting up the Funny Coffee Mug Challenge tomorrow at 10 o'clock a.m. And what I showed you here, kind of how I do it, and how I sort it, and how I find them, uh, that's the research part. That's just one part of the whole thing. A lot of you guys in my group and on my channel, you're already in there, uh, in my forums. But this is how you join. You go here, go to this page. You can read all the fun stuff you want. But the basic gist is this, you ha you need to go and click this, join today, and then you'll see this dollar trial for seven days, and then it does convert to a full membership. It's with PayPal, click next, get in there. Then when you get in there, you'll be brought right into the lovely forums. And inside the forums, we've got everything. We've got uh, general discussion. There's a whole bunch of stuff going on here. You're not gonna be the first person in here, by the way. Uh, success, we've got success stories. First sale, everything, right? First, 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 hundred, new campaign. Test got three sales, new milestone, 200 sales. At last, never give up, $1,000. There's me, 1495 profit at one o'clock PM. Big day, first sale on Shine On. This one, huge, made 10,000 to, made a, basically in the gear bubble contest they ran, he did awesome. So there's a bunch of stuff there. And then this is the key right here. This is where I'm gonna be running it. There's already people getting ready and they're just setting their goals. So this is like 5k per month, 2000 per month. I'm in want to get at least 2000 per month. I'm in. So there's a training here too. And there's a link down in there. Uh, so there's a bunch of setup videos in case you're new to it, but I do walk you through step by step. So you just kind of experience a little taste of what I offer. 
on the forums. And uh, I hope to see everybody in the group on the forums because it's a buck, like a dollar, one dollar to get in for seven days. And then that'll get you into at least the first live training session. You can see if you like it. I just spent uh, $2 and two cents on my large coffee from Tim Hortons this morning, which is more than I'm charging for this training. So you'll get at least one full live training session for a buck. Then you stay on, you'll get the rest of them. And then you stay on, you get more. So what I'm doing is every single month of the year, I've got a new challenge launching. Some of them are evergreen. Some of them are tied to holidays. But the key is, uh, as long as you're taking action and you're doing something that you love and something that will pay the bills, it's a good thing. So I'm I'm kind of excited about having this new tool, too, where I can live uh, do lives to uh, Facebook and to YouTube at the same time. Uh, if you're not on YouTube, Please go there, search for my channel, PPC Coach. I'm the only one on there, and uh, subscribe because there's a lot of new videos going up there too. In fact, while well, I have you guys here, it is Wednesday, right? No, wait, it's today. Yeah, it's Wednesday. So on YouTube, I'll show you. I actually just put, oh, there, there's a live one. But if I go to my channel, so go here, go to my channel. And that was the one I tried before. Well, actually, I should probably delete both those. Uh, da -da. Here it is. How to determine if you have a winner. So I'm going to mute this. But somebody had asked me the other day, um, you know, what do you do? What do you do with your testing? So I showed a low-budget testing thing on here, how to test with, like, $3 ad sets. So this video, I just put it up uh, yesterday. It's already got 44 views. But this is what how to determine if you have a winner from your Facebook ad test campaign. So you guys can go there um, and and watch it. And basically, the plan is to be releasing at least one video. I don't know why it's not. Well, I'm, it's probably not loading because I'm streaming to two places and everything else. But go here and subscribe to my channel. Okay. So when you subscribe, make sure you hit this. I don't even know where the subscribe thing is. That's how new I am to Facebook. Or uh, Sorry, <laughs> YouTube. So I do have 3.23k subscribers, but I want to get that up to like 10,000 or 20,000. So go ahead, go to the channel, subscribe, and uh, hit the notification bell too. I guess that's what they say, this thing, so that you can see uh, notifications that come in from me. Alrighty. Okay, I'm going to close. I'm going to end this off because I do have other work I got to do today, and I got to prepare to start tomorrow when we go actually with the first live training session on the forum. So if you haven't signed up yet, please go because the dollar, um, the dollar limited trial, the trial, well, sorry, $1 access for seven days is a limited time offer. And once this timer expires, the offer is gone. You can still join, but you can't join for a buck. So you're going to have to pay the full price. So I would love to have you in there. Uh, go ahead and join and you'll see a lot more, I just showed you the research today. Um, all we're at right now is basically this. But now what do you do next? Like, how do I get these made? How do I create them? How do I launch them? How do I, most importantly, get people's eyeballs on these things? So we, we have to have people looking at our stuff in order to buy it. And that's the hard part. Um, with coffee mugs, there's not much margin to play with at all. So we have to make sure that we know what we're doing. And that means that we can't be running... Um, gigantic campaigns like we can't use the same methods on coffee mugs that we'll use on like a necklace okay we have to be a little bit different because they are different so they don't respond the same uh, they can go viral and they can make a lot of money but anyway go here and join that's my point <laughs> you've you got a little taste go join we will see you in there now i'm going to see if i can shut this thing off correctly because i'm not quite sure how uh, so if i screw this up i apologize but we will see you tomorrow, and uh, maybe if you guys want to see any more lives or me look at anything live or show you anything live, let me know in the group, and uh, we'll help you out. All right, have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow on the first live training.